Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is the Trudicker and Frog and today I'll be your host. Today we'll be opening some tins, but not just any kind of tin. We'll be opening the square ones or the cubic ones. I don't know how you call them, but anyways, these little tins with types. So we'll be opening the fighting slash ground slash uh, rock type. I would say lichen rock or uh, cubone are my favorite out of these. This is just a random fighting bird, and this is just a random fighting thing that I'll be really careful. Let's go with Cubone! Then we have the Dark One with Umbreon, Upstagoon, Zoark, and the Guzzlord. I don't really like Guzzlord. But Umbreon, Upstagoon, and Zoark are very nice. So you know what? I'll, I'll put Umbreon! And to complete the trio, we have the Fire One, which has Scorbunny. Uh, that's, is that the final? No, that's not the final one. Is that Delphox then? I keep forgetting. We have Victini and Charizard. Now that the trio is acquired and completed, we now open packs. So yeah, we'll just open all three of them and uh, put the packs out. Then we'll dig into it. Personally, I didn't do any research on these boxes. I just decided to get them because I have the three of the previous uh, types. We have two Lost Origin and one Chilling Rain. Okay, that's not so good. And we have one coin, which is an Eevee coin. Oh, yay. I think that's... Is that the same one from the previous ones as well? Ah, uh, geez, that sucks if it's the case. Anyways, uh, so yeah, that's, you know... I didn't really do any research on these because I just wanted to uh, get my hands on them and uh, be done with it, I guess. How do you say this? Uh, I just wanted to complete my set is what I wanted. You know, since I already have the three of the previous one, which were water, grass, and electricity or, you know, thunder or whatever you call it. Since I already had those three, might as well complete the set, right? Two Lost Origin, one Chillin' Rain. Put those aside there. We'll do a little competition. Oh, right, there's the coin. Is it the same? Is it gonna be Eevee again? It's the same size, that's for sure. And it's... It's not Eevee! It's Zoark! Zoark... Zo no, that's not Zoark. What's the name of this one? It starts with a Z, doesn't it? Ah, damn. I fail as a Pokemon Master. I failed. There we go. Anyways, it's, uh, it's, uh, I forgot its name. I actually forgot its name because it came out during a generation I didn't really play and I don't believe I've pulled any of it, uh, anywhere actually. It's a thunder monkey thing. I don't remember. Then we have three more packs and a coin seems to be stuck in it. Is it going to be the same coin? Or is it going to be a different one? It's... It's Score Bunny! Hey, that's actually different. And this one is a little less silver and a little more gold. Interesting! We have coins of variety now. And the three packs are... Two Lost Origin, One Chillin' Rain. Okay, so let's start with the fighting one first. Let's go! Chilling Rain. What can we still get from this that is interesting? I would say the gold version of Snorlax. Oop, there we go. Gold version of Snorlax would be nice. Code card was for you guys. Don't worry about that. Can we get the Snorlax? Can we get the Snorlax? Reverse, Hatina, and nothing at the end. It happens. You know, it's, uh, it's the first pack. It's okay. Lost Origin! Can we get anything good in here? Well, I don't know. Can we? There are some very interesting Trainer Gallery cards in here. There are the uh, Giratina cards as well, which aren't half bad. I think we're gonna get a pull, because I saw a little bit of bordering, but it doesn't mean it's a good pull. It could be a shit pull. Eh, you know, it's one pull per three pack on average, so any kind of pull is, you know, it's uh, on ratio, which is nice. We have Spectre. Not quite sure if that's a good Pokemon or not, but it seems to be good. And we have Drapion V. It's a pull. 
it's on schedule with the ratios. You know what? I'll put this a little closer there. So this guy is not off camera. And we have our final pack of the fighting tin. Honestly, these tins, you buy them for the tin itself. The packs inside aren't so difficult to find. At the same price, you would get the tin if you really wanted the packs and not the tin. You could maybe save a buck or two. Uh, but yeah, the tin itself, about, you know, it's about $15, which is about the, the price of three of these packs. Uh, the pulls aren't as lucky as if you bought a booster box so you don't buy these tins over a booster box you buy the tins for the tins because they stack and they look nice uh so yeah back on schedule we have a dugong reverse and nothing on the end so yeah first box fighting box mostly just one v now on to the dark box we'll keep the fire one for the end there we go, opened the Chilling Rain pack, here's the code for y'all at home, one, two, three, four. Can we pull the Snorlax? Uh, can we pull the Snorlax? It would be nice. Justified and Weeding Gloves. Reverse Blitzel on a little iceberg and nothing on the end. Why am I not surprised? Well, you know what guys, I'll stop being pessimistic, let's start being optimistic. We deserve a good pull. We will get a good pull. We have a total of nine packs today, you know? It can't all be lucky. We will get something. Is the V-Star marker a sign of luck? Well, you know, maybe. Maybe it is. Vile Plume reverse and nothing on the end. Well, you know what? That's okay. There's still one pack left for this mini box. This mini tin. Are we going to get lucky on the final pack of the tin? It could happen. You never really know until it's done. And ooh, I see some foiling on the border ring there. Ooh la la, we're getting a pull. Are we gonna get a good pull? I don't know. Am I being overly optimistic? Probably so. Is that a problem? I don't think so. Because if it brings us this kind of luck, it can't hurt. It can't hurt. We've got the boys. We've got a reverse phalanx. It's the boys with a golden card at the end. It's Dark Patch. Is that any good? I don't know. Is it a gold card? Yes, it is. Dark Patch. It looks like something I've already pulled. Did I already pull one of these as gold card? I remember this card from the from before. I just don't remember if it was a gold or if it was a full art. Anyways, it's a gold card. It can't hurt. Gold cards usually go for at least early double digits, and the box was about early double digits, so it can't be all bad, right? But that, in Chilling Rain, could have been a Snorlax, and that's what we're looking for in this one. Let's go Snorlax, come on out. You've pulled a gold card, you know you can appear now. <sighs> there we go. The gold card for y'all at home. One, two, three, four, to the front. Can we get something? I don't think so, but we never know. Let's be optimistic. You know, happiness comes to those who try to reach for happiness. And yeah, it doesn't happen this time. But you know what? It's okay. We still have two packs. We still have two packs. Up to now, we're not, we're not in our money. But, but, we're in our ratios. And you know what? Being in your ratios is half the battle, you know? Getting the good pulls, that's the other half. And we have another pull in this little pack here. I've seen some bordering, unless that bordering was this black card. I hope it was not. Oh no, I see some bordering still. So we might we might get a decent pull here. We might get a decent pull because we're optimistic. We have Litwick here as a reverse. And on the end we have a full arts enamorous V. <laughs> Okay, so um, for those of you guys who are new to the channel, uh, a video around the time where this one is uploaded was me opening the Zoroark uh, V-Star Premium Collection box thing. And uh, I pulled an Enamorous V, regular. Well, that video is literally filmed about five minutes ago, like just, just, just before this video. And now we have the full art version of that little sucker. Uh, I don't know if I should 
sleeve it or not, but for now at least, it will be sleeved until it goes in a binder. Uh, I don't really give a crap about Enamorous, but it is a full art, and uh, the background looks pretty nice, so I can't really complain. It's a pull! We've got a pull in each box. This one is a little lackluster, but the other two, you know, they might be worth uh, maybe half to full of their respective box's value. We still have one pack left, can it help us make this one's value back? Come on, Trainer Gallery would be nice, uh, you know, a Rainbow Card would also be nice. You never really know what you're gonna get until you get. But are we gonna get anything? Uh, I have my doubts. I have my doubts. But doubting is okay. Doubting is okay. Reverse is a Radiant! That helps us, it's something I've already pulled a couple times, but Radiant Steelix, and on the end we have Glycebor, I'm tired of seeing that one, but Radiant Steelix, nice! So the middle one, the Charizard one, was lucky. We pulled two pulls, although this is a reverse pull, so eh, but it is a nice pull. It is a pull, and it helps compensate for the fighting one. So I believe out of the three tins, we have at least two that paid themselves back, Maybe two and a half overall. We did have all of this stuff with it. So even if it's not worth much, it's still worth something uh, So yeah overall not the best, but since I collect the tins it can't hurt that much, right? It's still worth it. Uh, we got some coins as well. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed today's video I know I somewhat did. Yeah, it's, it's been it's been nice. It's been a good time and until next time guys and gals It has been a pleasure Ciao I've got a few thanks to give. First, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, sub, bell, comment, share, etc. It really helps. Second, I want to give a big thanks to my friend BuddhaBelly42 for making the animation for the channel's intro. It is much appreciated. Go check him out on his social media accounts. Third, but not the least, I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who supports me my channel, and its mission, especially the ones on Patreon. You peeps out there are the ones making this work. On that note, follow me on my other social media accounts. Lots of bonus content to entertain you guys and gals, so check it out!